Hello, this is Ron Clark, and you're listening to Lesson 1 of the Self-Healing Archaeus. I call this technique an Archaeus because it's patterned after an alchemical work known as the Archaeus of Water. In this alchemical work, one takes a volume of water and separates it into its elements through a process of distillation. Once the parts are separated and purified, they are recombined or reintegrated resulting in an empowered water that has faculties it didn't possess before. The self-healing Archaeus follows this same alchemical pattern of separation, purification, and subsequent reintegration, but instead of water, our subject is the three-part human body. Like Bardon, the Archaeus defines three bodies, which correspond to three realms, mental, astral, and physical. The healing effects of the Archaeus are achieved through the conscious manipulation of these three bodies, and most especially through their integration. At every step in the Archaeus, one works in conscious cooperation with the pathways of influence and power which nature herself provides. The technique mimics one of nature's most essential processes, integration plus separation plus reintegration, the rhythm of life itself. To this fundamental equation is added the practitioner's own magical will along with the focus of healing. Lessons 1, 2, and 3 are concerned with the complete awareness of each body and their integration with each of the others. Lesson 1 with the complete awareness, relaxation, and integration of the physical body. Lesson 2 with the complete awareness of the astral body and its conscious integration with the physical body and Lesson 3 with the complete awareness of the mental body and its conscious integration with the astral and physical bodies. Lesson 4 and 5 are concerned with the passive separation of these bodies one from the other and with their subsequent reintegration. During the period of separation each body naturally achieves a degree of rest unknown to it by any other means. The Archaeus takes full advantage of this healing byproduct of their restful solitude. Lesson 6 is concerned with the purification and balancing of each solitary body and the subsequent reintegration of those balanced bodies. This is achieved through the loading of each body with the four elements in their appropriate regions. The final lesson, 7, is concerned with a higher form of integration that of integrated self-expression through the consciously unified and elementally balanced physical astral mental body. The Archaeus is designed to be pursued in conjunction with the work of initiation into Hermetics. Lessons 1, 2, and 3, which are focused upon integration, are suitable to any of Bardon's steps. Lessons 4 and 5, however, which are focused upon separation, should only be pursued after the completion of step two and the attainment of the rudimentary elemental equilibrium. Lesson six, which pertains to manipulation of the four elements, should only be pursued after good progress has been achieved with step four and the work of accumulating the elements. And finally, lesson seven should not be undertaken until the work of step six has begun. So, Let's move on to the practice of Lesson 1 and the complete awareness, relaxation, and integration of the physical body. Situate yourself comfortably. It's best if you sit upright with your hands resting gently on your thighs as this will help you resist the temptation to fall asleep during the relaxation phase. Close your eyes and clear your mind of all unwanted mundane concerns and thoughts. Now focus your attention upon your feet. Become aware of how your feet feel. Sense the toes and the arches and the tops of your feet. Now relax all the tension in your feet.
Now move your awareness upwards to your calves. Similarly, become aware of how your calves feel and relax away all of the tension stored in their musculature. Now move your awareness to your thighs. Note how they feel and relax their muscles. Now move to your buttocks and groin and relax all the muscles in this area. Relax all the tension from your abdomen and gut. From your lower back. Your upper back. Release all the tension from your chest. Relax your shoulders, arms, and hands. Relax all the muscles in your neck. Relax your jaw and mouth. Relax your nose. Relax your eyes, your cheeks, your ears. Now relax your scalp. Focus on how relaxed your entire body is at this moment. Now focus your awareness in the fire region of your head, from the base of your neck to the top of your scalp. Sense all the various parts that compose this region. Sense the skin that covers your head and face. Sense your eyes right and left. Sense your nose and sinuses. Sense your ears right and left. Sense your tongue, your teeth and lips. Sense your neck and throat. Now sense all of these parts of your head region at once. Put all of these sensations together and sense your whole head region as a single unit. Now move your awareness down to the air region of your chest, from the tops of your shoulders down to your solar plexus, including your upper arms, right and left, down to your elbows. Sense all the various parts that compose this region. Sense the skin that covers your torso. Sense the muscle and bone of your right upper arm and shoulder. Sense the muscle and bone of your left upper arm and shoulder. Sense your breathing lungs and your beating heart. Sense your upper spine, your ribs and breast. Now sense all parts of your chest region at once. Put all of these sensations together and sense your chest region as a single unit. Now move your awareness down to the water region of your abdomen from the bottom of your sternum to just above your genitals, including your forearms, right and left, from elbows to wrists. Sense all the various parts that compose this region. Sense the skin that covers the, your abdomen and lower back. Sense the skin, muscle and bone of your right elbow and forearm. Sense the skin, muscle, and bone of your left elbow and forearm. Sense your stomach, your intestines, 
your kidneys and all the other organs that fill your abdomen. Sense your lower spine and all the musculature that supports your abdomen. Now sense all the parts of your abdominal region at once. Pull all of these sensations together and sense your abdominal region as a single unit. Now move your awareness down to the earth region of your legs, from the top of your hips down to the soles of your feet, including your wrists and hands right and left. Sense all the various parts that compose this region. Sense the skin, muscle, and bone of your right wrist and hand. Sense the skin, muscle, and bone of your left wrist and hand. Sense the skin and muscle of your buttocks and the bone of your pelvis. Sense your genitalia. Sense the skin, muscle, and bone of your right thigh, your right calf, and your right foot. Sense the skin, muscle, and bone of your left thigh, your left calf, and your left foot. Now sense all the parts of your leg region at once. Put all of these sensations together and sense your leg region as a single unit. Sense the solid, supportive, earthy nature of this region as a whole. Sense it as the solid foundation upon which you stand. Now retain your awareness of the earthy leg region and add the watery region of your abdomen to this awareness. Sense your leg region and your abdominal region simultaneously. Sense the fluid, digestive, watery nature of your abdominal region and let it float atop the solid earth region of your legs. Sense how the water nature of your abdominal region penetrates the uppermost layer of the earth nature of your leg region, binding the two regions together. Now retain this awareness of the conjoined earth and water regions stretching from the bottoms of your feet up to your sternum and add the air region of your chest to this awareness. Sense your leg region, your abdominal region, and your chest region simultaneously. Sense the respiring light air nature of your chest region and let it hover over the fluid water region of your abdomen which floats atop the solid earth region of your legs. Sense how the air nature of your chest region mingles with the uppermost layer of the water nature of your abdominal region, binding the two regions together. Sense how these three regions connect one to the other and form a conjoined whole. Now retain this awareness of the conjoined earth, water, and air regions stretching from the soles of your feet up to the tops of your shoulders. And now add the fire region of your head to this awareness. Sense your leg region, your abdominal region, your chest region, and your head region simultaneously. Sense the active, expressive fire nature of your head region and let it dance upon the airy nature of your chest region, which hovers over the water nature of your abdominal region, which in turn floats atop the solid, earthy nature of your leg region. Sense how the fire nature of your head region consumes the uppermost layer of the air nature of your chest region binding these two regions together. Sense how these four regions connect one with the other, 
to form a single body. Sense your entire body as a single unified whole. Now visualize roots growing downward from the base of your spine, the palms of your hands, and the soles of your feet. Cause them to burrow deeply into the soil below your feet. From the soil below you, draw whatever energetic nutrients your body needs. Draw them up into the earth region of your body. Sense how the earth region passes these to the water region, and the water region passes these energetic nutrients to the air region, and the air region feeds them to the fire region. Sense how the fire region, thus nourished, sends a return energy downward into the air region, which in turn passes it to the water region. Sense how this energy flows from the water region down into the earth region and down still further through your roots to the soil below your feet. Release any excess energy you may sense within your body through your roots and into the soil below you. Release any negativity you may harbor through your roots and into the soil below you. Now turn your awareness away from your roots and return to sensing your whole body. Sense the earth region, the water region, the air region, the fire region, together. Sense the unification of these four regions. Now begin your return to normal awareness. Before opening your eyes or moving your body, take a moment to listen to the noises around you, to smell the air, and so on. Now take a deep breath and exhale it gently. Now move your hands up along your thighs and up your abdomen and chest, up to your face, and back down again, slowly awakening your body to normal sensation. Now gently open your eyes and slowly begin to move about. This ends Lesson 1 of the Self-Healing Archaeus concerning the complete awareness, relaxation, and integration of the physical body. I imagine by now you feel very relaxed. I suggest that you use this recording as your guide only for as long as it takes you to learn this technique. Once you have memorized the working pattern and have succeeded in following along with the recording a couple of times, you should try the technique solo, without use of the recording. It is imperative that you learn to perform this technique without my guiding voice if you wish to continue on to the next lessons. When this technique becomes easy for you to perform, you may move on to lesson two and the complete awareness and integration of the astral body. My best to you.